So what I discovered in this journey to find the best way to feed my dog, because I 100% believed it was everything, that was the one thing I could do for him to support him was his nutrition, and that was in my control. So I went out and I found freeze-dried raw dog food. Totally worked for me. Convenient, doesn't have to be thawed, doesn't have to be refrigerated. You open the bag, it's good for 30 days, and my dogs are big, so they go through it in a week. So it was amazing, it worked for me. The only problem was, is it was expensive. So I decided that everybody should have this available to them. I took a look at it and decided I'm gonna make my own food, I'm gonna create my own product so that I could do that for my dogs. Because I think that's where most great ideas come from, is people are creating a solution for themselves, really, and then going, hey, I think everyone would love this. So that's really what happened to me, even though I'm simplifying it, that's what happened for me. And so as I started to create this, I started getting feedback from customers. Love it, love it, great results, whiter teeth, better coats, not eating their poop anymore, not licking grass, not eating dirt. Like people are astounded by just this one simple change, right? Just feeding your dog something different. So what happened for me was I realized in that journey that people started giving me feedback and there were people that were upset. <laughs> they're like, it's almost like they blame the messenger, you know, for telling them the truth. And they're like, you know, one lady wrote in specifically and said, I have four golden retrievers. I've re rescued all of them. I have a part-time job to support the other two just so I can have enough money to support them. And I absolutely believe everything you told me and I'm devastated. And I wish I didn't know because I can't do anything about it. And she was very, you know, defeated by it. I ended up buying her a book, How to Make It Herself, and gave her all the tips to go and doing that. And she was committed to doing that. And that's what worked for her. But in that, I thought, you know what? I grew up financially challenged and I did not want to have a product that was only for the affluent or only for people who are willing to be really extravagant for their dog, I thought there's got to be a better way in the middle. And so that's where our whole product line started to evolve and develop. And so that's where we, you know, that we created this amazing product line now that can support your dog. No, most, no matter what you're feeding him as a base, we can put supplements around it to support him or her so your dog can live longer.